Good morning. I can't see my face. Good morning. It's our last day here at Bum Bum Island with ND Divers. Yes. We're very sad to go, but we still have like a lot of time here this morning from 8 a.m. to 2.30 p.m. So we're gonna eat some breakfast. And show you around. Do a little workout. When you're traveling, you don't really have a schedule, set schedule every day, and it's hard to get in a routine of working out. If you're in a place like this, beautiful, Got a place to work out. We try and do it every single time. <laughs> Big day for Anna. But we got our German friend over there swimming around the place as a workout. Now you guys Woo! know the truth. Ian's abs aren't natural. <laughs> okay. Breakfast time. Some garlic bread, some sausage. I always go with the classic peanut butter. He's already got it out over there. Peanut butter is the best. Crunchy. Anna, what are you going with? PB and J. PB and J? It's so weird. Back home, the bananas are like triple the size. Over here, I think they're more natural. Back in the United States, they somehow have like really, really big ones. Shout out to our friend Dom, who taught us that if the tip, when it's ripe, is green, that means that it had unnatural fertilizer on it but if it, the tip is brown that means it's all natural baby before we go here today i want to say five reasons i think that you should dive at nd divers reason number one they have a plastic initiative where they collect their own plastic and pay a garbage guy to come on a boat and take it back to a dump reason number two we were able to have some private dives on a private boat by ourselves. Reason number three, the staff. Momo, Andy, Alex, Dendi, all of them are so awesome, they're so funny, and they're just really chill. Reason number four are the cats. They're so cute and sweet. Reason number five is you can go swim over across the sea and go jump with some kids, and it's awesome and fun and it fills your heart. So that's just a quick tidbit on why ND Divers is awesome place to go diving. Packing up now, getting our things ready to get out of here. Very sad. We loved it. About to get some good food. It's like a Happy Meal. Ooh. I love it. Got some type of fish. Rice. Is this Sambo on top? Yeah, it's Sambo. Sambo. Just had a great lunch, and we were working on our computers over here, and we noticed this huge storm a brewing. We should probably put our computers away. Is that what you were saying? <laughs> oh, I thought even like our clothes. I was no, like... we should put our computers away. Yeah. I feel like Anna and I had really good luck for Saba with the weather and stuff. Everything's been, every tour, every day has been perfect. A little rain here, there, but now I think it's starting to pick up a little bit. But hey, I have a question for you. Did you celebrate Halloween? And if you did, what were you? Comment below, because I want to hear all your creative ideas. The crazy thing is that we were supposed to leave on a boat in about an hour's time. Hopefully the storm passes fast, but here's right outside our window. It does pass. We could risk it uh, by going out at 2.30, but it seems like it's gonna come soon. Yeah, I think it's gonna be powerful. And okay, well, let's keep going. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Sorry, yeah? Thank you. Like good old Southeast Asia fashion, the rain has stopped. Just like that. All right, we're headed down. <laughs> it's a big drop, Ian. Be careful. I guess. I step down first. <laughs> We'll miss you, Omo. Bye, Thank Momo. you. Bye. See you later. See ya. Bye, Thanks bye. for everything. Yeah, you're welcome. Alex, We're going you're with Alex. Miss you. I'll miss you guys. Bye bye. Yes. Yes. I, think I, I think I did you. Okay. okay. Oh, See ya. Thank you.
check your messenger. Okay, see ya. at the Tawau Airport, about to head back to Kota Kinabalu for a couple days, catch up on videos, and I think we're gonna head on a day trip to uh, Kinabalu Park, where Mount Kinabalu is. Heading on our plane to KK. He is very tired. Very He's tired. We didn't tell you about our secret Sarawak trip. Yes. So. It's coming up. Yeah, comment if you're from there. Back in KK, we're going back to the same Airbnb that we enjoyed last time. Chong's Airbnb. We're excited to go back. Very weird. We didn't expect to be back so soon. Thank you. Hello, how are you? Oh my Thank gosh. So Feels like yesterday, Hi. legit. What's up? How are you? Really weird being back somewhere you've already been. Like, it's not like we just like stop by here. Like, we were here for a while. Like, yeah, we were here for a while. It was helpful like four days, five days. This is my editing desk back here, so I'm gonna go pretty hard over the next 24 hours right there. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up, comment down below. We're gonna keep having fun. But we need a little work day. Yeah, work day breather. Breather. I think some of you don't understand how hard it is because you're always like, well, we're waiting for the video. I'm like, it's coming. It's gonna take some time, guys. It does take some time, guys. especially for the more like the the more not important ones, but the more adventurous ones. There's a lot of video to go through and stuff. But and GoPro takes forever. To GoPro go. does take forever. We're loving it though. Yeah. It takes time. We love you guys. Have a good night. See you in the next one. Yep. I was made to be free.